Okay, you probably read the title of this video and say, what the fuck, Frank? Frankie, what the fuck? You hit women? You, you're fucking Ray Rice now, Frankie? I'm gonna dislike the video, you fucking domestic violence motherfucker! Fuck! <laughs> anyway, uh, before this video starts, I just want to give a quick shout out to Azer. Go check out his channel. It'll be in the description, so you should go look at that. But anyway, look at this Tomahawk. Look at this Tomahawk just doing the do. Look at that thing doing the do. Doing the do, I just made that up. But anyway, before this video starts, I just wanted to say that this is completely on accident. I did not mean to hit this girl. Things just unfolded in a manner in which it wasn't very good for me or her and her face. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you enjoy this video, please drop a like. More videos to come. And I'll talk to you guys at the end. Peace. Okay, so this story begins in my town. My town, I'm not going to give it out because I don't want you guys showing up to my door with the Red Lobster biscuits in between your cheeks asking for some kinky shit. So I'm just I'm just going to say in the suburbs of Chicago because that's where I live. So anyway, me and my family are walking down the side, sidewalk going down to this uh, local Dairy Queen. Now this local Dairy Queen is about 15 minutes from my house. So, you know, my, my brother was a uh, infant at the time, so he was in a stroller. So we were just strolling our family down to this Dairy Queen. And on the way to Dairy Queen, we didn't know this, that guy just got blown up by that car. Um, so on the way to Dairy Queen, we, I didn't know this, but apparently my friend lived right by the Dairy Queen. And as we were walking down to this Dairy Queen, he was playing in the front yard. And since me and this kid are good friends, and since our parents know each other very well, you know, I just went into his backyard to hang out with him as my parents were just chatting with uh, his mother. Now, my friend, he's a little bit younger than me. He's a grade lower, and he has a sister that's in that's my grade. And around this time, this was about, I want to say, fifth grade. I'm just going to give a rough, rough estimate and say fifth grade. So, you know, fifth grade me just chilling with my friend in the backyard, and he gets out this, um this club, this, uh, I, I, I don't know golf that well, I'm just, I'm just gonna go with club. So he gets out this club, and he hands me a ball, and he's just like, hit it as hard as you can. Now, being fifth grade me, I wasn't really developing what consequences might occur if I were to wind up and swing this shit. God forbid where the ball goes through a window hitting an old woman in the breast, you know, God forbid that, or just something happening where I wind it back and it hits someone, which is the case. So, he hands me this ball and tells me to hit it as hard as I can. So I put the ball down. I didn't have like a little stand like those golfers have on the grass where they tee off on. Oh, it's called a tee. I'm fucking dumb. Anyway, they, he didn't have a tee, so I was just like hitting it off the concrete. So I put this ball down, and his sis apparently his sister came out. I, I didn't hear her come out. I didn't hear her open the door. She was just apparently back there. So I go to wind up, and as I, I'm like... I'm, I'm a stronger kid. I'm not trying to brag or anything, but I have some... I, my arms are pretty toned, so I'm, I'm pretty strong. So as I'm winding this club back, it smacks his sister in the face. And keep in mind, this was on her fucking, like, communion. She was in her dress and everything. She had a crown on, she had a whole dress, and I smacked her in the face with the club on her communion day. And, uh, you know, she's immediately crying. I'm sitting there with this club looking like fucking... I don't, even, I don't even know. I look like the most guilty person on the face of the planet at this point. So, I just clubbed this chick in the face. She runs into the front yard of her mom. Now, now she was crying so much, she didn't actually, like, tell her what happened. She just saw that she had a bruise on her face. And her mom didn't, like, yell at me or anything. And, it, and meanwhile, her, her little brother and my friend's just sitting there with this mouth fucking wide open, just looking at me. Bro, you just clubbed my sister in the face. That was awesome. I'm like, no, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. I'm sitting there. I'm getting all emotional because she probably needs some kind of like facial reconstructor, reconstructor or something. So in the end, in the end, uh, it was a very bad experience for me. I still have like vivid PTSD flashbacks of just the like winding it back and having it hit her right in the cheek and feeling that hit her right in the cheek, like through the club. It was so bad. And I knew it was going to hurt. And yeah, we ended up getting Dairy Queen. Uh, needless to say, I didn't enjoy it as much as I thought I would because of the flashbacks I was having. Uh, so yeah, just in life, don't try to hit girls in the face with clubs. And you know, maybe it will life will treat you well. Maybe you won't have that horrible test grade or something. I don't know. Just try not to hit women in the face with clubs. Just try not to hit women in general. Holy shit. Fucking hell. Probably watching this video. Oh, since Frankie hit a chick, I'm gonna go hit my mom. Please, no. Don't hit women. Shit. 
All right. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please leave a like, and I'll talk to you guys later. More videos to come. I love each and every one of you. Don't do drugs. Stay in school. Play Xbox. Simple as that. And don't hit women. Please. Don't hit women. It's bad. It's very, very bad.